Hey guys, Ben here and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about The Flash Season 6 Episode 8. We're going to be breaking down the trailer. And so the trailer's come out. It's not like super good quality because the CW hasn't officially released it. But this was again recorded online. TV promos got it. So that's why we've got it. Obviously it's not up to standard but that will be like later today. They will upload it better. But you know we've got to get the video out. So... Anyway, let's go ahead, and if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. Let's go ahead and get into this, start breaking it down, talking about everything that's happening, but before we get into that, like I mentioned in the earlier video today, which you should check out, I have a new feature on my channel where you can become a member. You can click the join button, which should be like pretty close to the subscribe button, on the home page when you just go to my videos or you know you can see it right now when you're on the video you can click join don't go for the higher ones at the moment because they have been taken away and I'm just sticking to the lower prices but basically you can become a member and by becoming a member you support the channel you support me it's like a monthly thing it's kind of like patreon but it's better and we're gonna be sticking to it and there's some great benefits one of the cool benefits that I'm going to be doing and I'm really excited about because it's something completely new, I haven't seen anyone do this, but I think like every month or every few weeks I'll get some of you guys who are members and I will put you on Discord and we'll talk, but it will be in a live stream on the channel. So you get to be on the channel actually talking, talking about DCTV, we can discuss, you know, like the week of the news and you know, whatever, you know, maybe the episode's coming out or maybe it's towards, you know, in the summer and we can talk about Comic Con and stuff like that. So I'm very excited about this feature and hopefully as many of you guys can join and become members as possible because it would really mean the most to me, but also it's going to have some cool benefits for you guys so it's not, you know, just one-sided. But thank you for your support. Let's go ahead and get right into today's video. So. The first shot of the trailer is of the city, of Central City, and it's all going dark, it's all going black. That is because, you know, Ramsey has taken over the whole city. I don't know if that's actually going to happen in the episode, but basically we're going to have sort of like a zombie, kind of zombie land episode where loads of people were infected via Ramsey's infection. And so, yeah, that seems to be what's going on in the first shot of the trailer. And so at the start of the trailer, we get the voice overlay. I think it could be Caitlyn. I'm not... 100% sure on the voice, but it's definitely a female saying Ramsey's spreading his infection Obviously, that's what we see throughout this trailer and then we've got this shot of Cecile So it seems like Cecile and possibly I think in the trailer. It's Camilla as well They seem to be getting attacked by I think it's Barry Obviously, it could be like any of the people like who are infected, but probably gonna be Barry But they're at some sort of place. I don't know where it is I can't really crack it down, but it's kind of dark, it's purple, you see her hiding behind this wall, and there is a figure moving in the background. Okay, so then we go to Barry and Iris' apartment. Obviously, Barry is infected, he's a negative flash, essentially, you know, his speed force has been corrupted, as seen in last episode. Go check out my review, which went out just a few hours earlier prior to this. And so, she says in the scene, Barry. And then we get the reply, I think it's via Cisco, he goes... He's gone, that's not him, and then this is what happens. So she's there in the apartment, we get the shot of Barry from behind. Obviously it looks like, oh he's just in a suit, he's in an apartment, he's acting a bit weird. But then she obviously gets the big reveal in a minute. But then we first go back to another shot of Iris in the trailer. A bit closer you get to see like the outline of Barry sort of all blurred out. And then she gets the big reveal, oh shit, he's been taken over, he is you know, not himself, you can easily see that, because, you know, his eyes, they're pure black, his teeth, they've got like, so they look like grills or something, like black grills, you know, his teeth are infected with this darkness, his costume has changed, and he just looks overall more demonic than a normal looking human Barry, and uh, yeah, I really like the touch on the actual suit, like you can see in his earpiece, it's actually all practically done like that you could see from the set photos we got a while back when he was infected and when they were shooting they actually changed the symbol on the suit they changed the earpieces to make them all dirty and look all infected and obviously his speed force color has changed it's black and white we've never seen that i thought that was really really amazing 
and it was very shocking to me at the end of the episode when he ran and it was that color and I was like oh my god this is so cool okay so then we move on to the next shot of the trailer this is one outside we got CCPD we got a bunch of people running around in the street and so what's happening here is there is infected people all around and they're attacking people obviously so the CCPD are trying to stop it and then we go to Iris and Iris in the trailer says I'm not giving up on my husband. There's a little glitch in the trailer where she goes, I'm not, not, not giving up on my husband. I don't know, that's just like an editing error. So let's move on to the next shot. We get this of Cisco, and he says in return to what looks like Iris, he goes, if you go out there, you could get infected. So he's extremely worried, obviously emphasized by the close up of the camera, you know, how close it is to his face, essentially. And so then we move on and we go to that same street looks like there's someone in the background don't know if that's one of our heroes or not could be or it could just be a civilian but we've got one of these zombies that Ramsey has actually taken over in the middle of the street and the CCPD are trying to contain him and contain other people like him so then we move on to the next shot the next shot is inside this similar hallway to where Cecile was before the lighting's changed a little bit not sure why but it doesn't actually in the end look like it's Barry. So I can't specifically crack down as to who he is. It may be just someone completely random and completely new. And so it seems like this is Camilla and Cecile as well together being attacked. Then we go over back on the street. We've got Joe and Joe says, Flash, this is not you. So the Flash has run in obviously. And he is obviously the negative Flash. He's not himself. He's been taken over. He is doing bad deeds because he is in control by blood work as seen in this next shot which is my favorite shot of the trailer so exciting you get to see blood work who i think is pretty good i don't think he's amazing but i thought he was like he's definitely better than some of the past villains we've had recently including cicada and the thinker he's very interesting right now and obviously he's completely jacked up on this sort of energy and you know Barry's been taken over he's standing right next to him and his eyes are fully black like I said his teeth his suit slightly changed and I just think it's super exciting to see a bad version of Barry he's obviously probably got no control but I reckon there's a little bit inside of him that is going to be the way that he's going to break through and I think Iris is going to be the one probably to break through to Barry and snap him out of it. Obviously they'll need to defeat Bloodwork and this is Bloodwork's final episode as well so that is to be kept into consideration when going into this episode. Okay so we go back to that hallway, it looks like a very similar hallway to where Cecile was before and so this guy is trying to attack what looks like Cecile and also Camilla and now I look at it, now I see the doors, it does look like this is Ralph's place and also Iris's office so Seems like they're getting attacked in the office, you know, Cecile maybe was just in there chilling or whatever And they're getting attacked by this sort of zombie figure. Don't know who it is though Okay, so then we've got this shot of Ramsey and he's obviously completely jacked up on his stuff His fingers are all black. They're extended. He's in the street So it does seem like he's controlling the flash in the middle of the street as well Which is very intriguing to see also, the final shot of the trailer, we've got Camilla and Cecile trying to break through what looks like their office door, or like Ralph's office door. And so, yeah, that's about it for the trailer. Potentially, later this week, I may be going to a Comic Con event. It's called Wales Comic Con. It's not in Wales, it's actually in Telford, kind of near to Birmingham. I've really last minute applied for press for it so potentially I may be there if any of you guys are going please be sure to say hi if you do see me because I love meeting you guys at these events and also at this event there is so many DC TV actors coming you got Tom Welling obviously he's coming in crisis he plays Superman on Smallville then you've got all these other Smallville people but also you got Matt Ryan who plays Constantine on Legends Arthur Darville who plays Rip Hunter on Legends Tyler Hoechlin, Superman, he's obviously going to be in Crisis, it's going to be amazing, also Brandon Ralph, there is so many that I could name right now, but also Shazam, that's actually another one, so Zachary Levi is going to be there, so fingers crossed, if I get in as press, I literally did it last minute, I will be attending that event for a day or two, and so please be sure to come and attend the event if you're from England or Europe or anywhere, 
There's going to be so many amazing guests. I will be there. I know DC World's going to be there. Maybe some other people as well. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll catch you guys later. Goodbye. I see room.